Hello, my name is Ionis. This is this video tutorial. I'm going to show you how to create an update query. First of all, what is an update query? An update query is the query which will allow us to update a large amount of data easily and quickly with very minimum effort. In this scenario, we were asked by the venue owners, let's open the venue table, that because we are loyal customers, we can actually receive from now on 20% discount on all the prices. But I do not want to update every single price manually, one by one. In this case, I'm going to go to Create and select Query Design. I'm going to select an Update Query and I'm going to select my table by clicking and dragging it. I'm going to increase the height. I'm going to double click on the header here and I'm going to click and drag to apply all the fields here. If I don't want to do that, I can actually, and I want to apply certain fields, like for example, the name, the address, the postcode, I can actually manually, individually, basically select, double click on each field, okay, to apply the fields that I, I wish to have on my query. So on the update to section for the cost here, okay, I need to put the, fo the following formula. So I'm in square brackets, I need to put the attribute, which is the cost, and then close the uh, square bracket. And I will say minus, and then in parentheses, I'm going to create my calculation, which is in square brackets is the cost, close the square brackets, times 0 0.2. Now, 0.2 this will give me the 20% so this calculation here it's gonna show me the identify the 20% and then I will deduct the 20% from the total price so I'm gonna click save now and I'm just gonna call this QRY remove 20% and then I'm just gonna click OK let's close this query so as you can see here my table venue i've got here on the first one i've got 100 100 pounds okay so the next one is 1200 pounds okay that one is 1600 pounds and one and a half thousand pounds now when i double click on this update query it's going to prompt me it's going to warn me that it will change the prices and then when i click ok these prices will automatically be reduced by 20%. So the first one is going to be from 100 pounds, it should be 80 pounds. Now, if 400 pounds goes to 80 pounds, I do not have to check the rest of the um, uh, records because I know it works. So I'm going to double click here. Yes, I want to update. Yes, it tells me how many records it will update. It's five. Yes, I've got five records here. Yes. And now I've got deduction of 20%. So as you can see, the 20% of 100 pounds is 80 pounds. The 20% of the other prices basically reduced. So I do not have to manually update uh, the prices. Now, if in the future the price increases by 20%, okay, or by 10%, I can actually replicate this query. I can actually copy that and control V to paste or right click and paste okay so I'm gonna put here instead of uh, remove I will say add add uh, let's say 10% okay add 10% so if the prices say for instance are increased by 10% I'm gonna right click here I need to modify my query here and here I need to put because I'm adding 10% I'm just going to replace the minus to plus and because it is 10% I'm just going to change to 0 0.1 so if I save this now and let's close this now if I go here now if I increase the price by 10% this should go to 88% because this is the adding 8% sorry 10 percent so by increasing 10 percent the 80 pounds it should give me 88 pounds so let's double click on this query yes it gives me the warning yes it tells me that it's going to update five records okay 
and I can see now 88%, so I know it works. So this is how you create an update query to calculate automatically, to update automatically um, uh, records. I hope you've learned something new today. I hope you will be able to apply these new skills onto your database. Thank you very much for watching. Bye for now.